Let's talk about integrity in leadership. If there's one thing that will scare people away, that's integrity. When people leave organizations, it's because they're asked to do things that clash with their core values. As a leader, it's your utmost responsibility to be integrous. What does it mean? Well, you have some principles and the organization stands for some values. And those values most likely are written somewhere and they're published in a kind of a, on your internal websites and, and in the boardroom and on the walls of the organization. But if they're not lived out by leaders, what it does, it sends a message to the people that we don't really care about these things. There is a mismatch. You don't walk your talk. And so that's a sign that, well, there is a, there is a problem with, with integrity there. And so in any situation, when we need to make a decision, we can do two things. We either adjust and bend our principles to match our actions, or we bend our actions to match our principles. So in other words, if we have made a mistake, we can either bend the principles to actually say that that mistake was not actually a mistake, or we can admit that mistake and say, yeah, that's right, that's not what we should do, this is not according to our values, so we should correct that, and that's not an acceptable behavior. But you as a leader, you set the stage for all that. And how do you show integrity? Well, you have good values, right? Um, honesty, trustworthiness, those are good values. You make some decisions before you're put in a situation to make those decisions. In other words, you put some guardrails. These are things that we're not going to do no matter what. You decide that you don't have a price. That's again, it's setting the stage for what's going to happen. Because here is what I know. If the leader lacks integrity, what's going to happen is that you're going to attract the people that lack integrity. And if you bend the rules here, then your people are going to bend the rules there. And then someone else is going to bend the rules there. And then maybe you're going to take advantage of a client here and a supplier there. And what happens is that you're going to create the culture of lack of integrity. And so I can't state how important integrity is for a leader because you could spend the whole entire career to build integrity, and you can lose integrity in a snap of a, of a finger. You could make a mistake that could lose you that integrity and, and credibility. So I can't state enough how important integrity is, and if there's one thing that will scare people away from you and your organization, is that lack of integrity, and all that comes from that.